guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to be reviewing Bomba's socks and I kind of want to start a new series on my channel where I review things that I purchased from Facebook slash Instagram ads because personally I feel like I am like the biggest sucker for those things. I feel like I'm always seduced by the Facebook ads. So if you're like me and you see those ads and wonder whether or not they're worth buying, then hopefully you will get something out of these videos. And just to give you a little synopsis of some of the ads, basically these socks are advertised as being like the most ideal athletic socks, super comfortable. Supposedly they're like the perfect socks. Um, also, there is a bit of an ethical component to it. They do um, donate one pair of socks to a homeless shelter for every sock pair that you purchase. So that's basically the gist of the company and kind of what the advertising is all about. So if you want to see my pros and cons and what I think about these socks, then just keep watching. To start with, um, I have the original women's ankle socks, um, and I think this is like a canary yellow color. Uh, basically, it's like a bee themed. They have like a honeycomb. They say Bombas on them, and then they have a little bee with a little queen bee on there. Um, so these are just the original. These are in size medium. And so far I've had them for about a week. Um, I've tested them out. I've also washed them and tested them out after being washed. So I feel like I have a pretty good idea of what these socks are all about at this point. Um, so now let's get into the pros and cons and I'll start with the, the negatives first. So I would say the first problem that I encountered with these socks is the shipping time. The shipping time is really long. Um, so I ordered these and they took 15 days, over two weeks to get to me. The thing that was really surprising to me about that is they're shipping domestically just from a few states away. Um, it's not like these were being shipped from, you know, Asia or something like that, where a lot of times you get the long shipping times. This was a domestic shipment. Also, it was not free shipping. I paid $3.95 for shipping for a $12 pair of socks. So like a third of the cost in shipping. Um, I really just wanted to try them out. Obviously you could get a better shipping deal if you purchase more of them, but yeah. So the shipping was a pretty big disappointment. My second negative, to be honest, I don't think they're that comfortable. I mean, they're comfortable, but they're nothing special. I mean, I feel like, I feel like they honestly feel like any standard athletic sock. Yeah, and to be honest, they're not really my, my favorites. Um, personally, I really love the Asics um, women's athletic socks. They're a lot cheaper than these and I feel like they're just as good. Also for a more premium sock, I really love the Belega, I think that's how you say it, hidden comfort socks, which I actually do notice a difference in those being extremely comfortable. Um, but to be honest, I just wasn't blown away with the, the comfort level of these. And I think my main problem with them is this honeycomb um, part in the middle. So if you've ever had socks that have a pattern on them, you'll know that sometimes the pattern is, like doesn't stretch out as much as like the solid background color. And so sometimes pattern socks, not necessarily athletic socks, but really any socks can be a little bit uncomfortable. And for me, I felt that that happened with, the, with this. This part in the middle was just too tight, like it was, like the center portion of this honeycomb was basically like digging into my skin and I could feel basically the honeycomb pattern. So I actually double checked my size. I normally wear a size nine to a nine and a half and I double checked the size on the Bombas website and they say that a size medium should fit sizes eight to 10 and a half in women's. So my size should have been smack in the middle of the medium size range. They do have a slightly different size range for the no-show socks, um, but these are not no-show socks. These are just the traditional ankle socks. So I would expect them to be fit properly. Um, and actually on their websites, 
they say that if you're between sizes, you should order down, which makes me think that if you order up a size and maybe if I were to get a large, then I would have had an opposite problem where maybe it would have been like too long and kind of been shifty or something. I don't know, but that was disappointing. I have found after I've washed them, they have, the center part has softened up a little bit, but it's still kind of the same problem even now. So I would say that is the biggest downside, especially because they are expensive socks. Maybe it's just like my feet. It just like irritates me. Maybe other people have different experiences, but personally, I would say that's the biggest downside. That being said, now let's get into the positive aspects of these socks. So number one, I think they're just really cool. I like, I like that they do have this um, like comfort grip thing on the back of them. Um, I like the pattern. I like the yellow. They come in a bunch of really cool colors. Um, so I do like how they look. And then I think the other big positive is just the philanthropic nature of them. I really like that they donate socks for every one you purchase. On their website, they say that socks are um, one of the most requested items in homeless shelters, which I definitely can believe. So I think it's awesome that they're doing something to support that. Um, and yeah, that's it. Overall, I'd probably give these socks like a B minus, um, probably a C if they didn't actually have the uh, charity aspect to it. But ultimately, I think they're pretty average. I mean, they're I'll definitely wear them. I'm not gonna throw them away, especially because they're softening up a little bit when I wash them. Um, but yeah, I mean, I think they're pretty average athletic socks. Um, but I, I will definitely wear them. Maybe I will learn to like them more and I'm sure I'll get lots of use out of them. If you are interested in trying out these socks and seeing if you have a different experience than me or you're interested in um, supporting a company that has a, a charitable cause associated with it, um, I do have a referral code, which I think will give you um, some percentage off. So hopefully that will help with your first purchase if you are interested in purchasing them. If you have a different experience or you encountered any of the same issues as me, definitely let me down. Definitely let me know down below and that's it. See you next time. Bye.